right guys happy Monday it is February 7th welcome back to Hanson Never Done Farms as you can see I'm out here in the goat yard because when I came out to feed this morning I noticed Miss Bijou there did not have any ligaments and as you can see she looks like she's bagged up pretty good. I uh, brought my birthing stuff out just to have it out here. I've been in the house all morning, but thought I'd bring stuff out and just start getting things together. But uh, yeah, I think we're going to have babies at some point today. But. Uh, We'll see. We'll see. She's a new doe to me, so I've not been with her through this, so I don't know what her normal behavior is. She, when we bought her, was a very in-your-pocket doe. And, of course, as soon as she was bred, within 30, 45 days, she became very standoffish. She does not like, <laughs> now that I said that, of course, she's coming to me. She does not like her ligaments checked, um, so generally the only time I can check them is in the mornings, um, at feeding time, either in the morning or in the evening, but I'm definitely seeing some changes to her. Um, her udder is easily um, a quarter to a third bigger than what it was last night, so... I'm thinking today is the day. Um, regardless, I'm going to get everything together and we'll see what we see. I'm not seeing any signs of contractions other than if you look at that hooked tail. Her tail is pretty hooked. That uh, sometimes can be a pretty good sign that she's having a contraction. But let's see what she does if she stays squatted. And she does. There obviously is a little bit of pressure on her. But wow, she really did bag up pretty good. I think I'm going to, <clears throat> I think I'm going to, whoops, let me make sure you guys aren't on Zoom here. So you're not, you know, getting video of my nostrils. I'm going to clean out this stall and just for now put pine shavings down. And then as she gets closer and we know that it is indeed an impending birth, I will put straw in there. Um, but anyways, guys, look at what Jeff did yesterday. He got out here and we moved my stanchion in here. He moved hay around and put one of the shelving units out here. So I actually have a little bit more room, believe it or not. It doesn't, it seems pretty cramped, but as we start going through some of the hay, it won't take long. Um, I'll have a little bit more room in here, but of course I have my kitting kit. That's the main kit. And then my small box is out here. And guys, we shall see what we shall see. Anyways, if, um, as you know, it takes 24 to 48 hours for us to post a video. So if this does happen today, um, you're going to find out first, either on Facebook or Instagram. Follow us there, Hanson Never Done Farms. I will post updates and pictures there. But I just wanted you all to be aware that we're going to have babies. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm excited. So give us a like, subscribe, and share. Share this video out so 
we let everybody know that Hanson Never Done Farms is back in the Nigerian dwarf baby business. It's happening, you guys. See ya later.